Hi, thank you for coming in today and filling out our forms in the lobby. I think what we do here at Physical Therapy would be a great fit for you. I understand you've been having some pain with your lower back and it spreads into the backside of your right leg. Well, I believe it could be due to uh, one of the discs in your spine. So in between each vertebrae or piece of your spine, there's going to be a disc in between that kind of takes off some of the pressure whenever you're standing or doing any kind of long-term driving or semi-heavy lifting. So I think it's irritating one of the nerves next to it, and that's what's sending that pain from your back down to the backside of your leg. So when I had you doing the repeated standing extensions just like that with your hands on your hips, just leaning back repeatedly, that was to relieve some of that pain and hopefully add some relief <clears throat> to when you sit for long periods of time or lift those semi-heavy objects. So I think that would be a great place for us to start. How would you feel about that? Really? Awesome. Okay, great. So another thing I would like for you to do, and I'll put this all in your home exercise program uh, on a handout, but another thing I'd like for you to do is a prone press up. So what it's going to be is you're going to have your, you're going to lay down on your stomach on a bed or on the floor or anything like that. And you're going to have your elbows pressed on the floor just like this with your arms tucked at your side. And what you're going to do is just slowly extend up keeping your elbows on the ground, but keeping your your hips in line as well, and just slowly press up. And you should feel a stretch on your abdomen and some relief of pain on your lower back. And if you feel like that's too minimal, you're not getting much out of that, then you can always just extend your arms completely. Yeah, and, and you can do that uh, for about three sets of 10 reps, about twice a day, at least for the standing extensions. And then for the press-ups, I'm going to have you do three sets of holding that for 30 seconds, and again, twice a day. But if you ever do feel pain coming on during any of those exercises, um, just please take note of it, write it down, and then just stop the exercise. But again, also, if you feel like you're in pain and you need to do it more than twice a day, you're, you're also welcome to do that. Um, so before I grab the HEP for you, um, I'd like for you to show me just some of those exercises just to make sure that we're on the same page and when you go home, you know, you're hitting all the points. Perfect, that was great. So this handout will outline the exercises I just showed you. And if you ever feel unsure about that, you know, like I said, make note of it, give us a call. Um, but then again, I, I really don't feel like that'll be a problem here. Yeah, so thank you. So you should start noticing your pain going away in about a month or two, as long as you stick to the HEP. And I know that you had some concerns with this kind of being an issue so early on in your life. This is a really common occurrence, especially in people in your field who spend a lot of time on, on the road or do any kind of periodic semi-heavy lifting without really any warm-up. So this is really something manageable. And I think we can get it to go away as long as we strengthen that surrounding musculature around your spine. Great question. Yeah, so, so I'd like for you to come back twice a week for the next two months or eight weeks. I know you're worried about this happening again, but for the foreseeable future, uh, if you find pain coming on during a long drive, just feel free to stop, walk around, or do any of the uh, repeated extension exercises that I showed you. And that should help to relieve some of that pain and if you find yourself feeling better at the end of the two months then we can always discharge you early if that sounds okay with you great okay so when you do come back we are going to try some different exercises for your back to strengthen the muscles of course and as well as take off some of that pressure you've been feeling so again i'll be doing some of that manual therapy like i showed you earlier well, i'll be putting my hands on your lower back and uh, some of the stuff we also will be doing will cause a little bit of discomfort. But again, this is all just part of the process and trying to get you to feel better sooner. So also, one of the, some stuff that I'm going to have you go home with, uh, just pay a little bit of attention to your pain for the next couple of days. If there's any kind of activities that you weren't able to communicate with me today uh, that you're having trouble with, please come back, let us know about that, and uh, I'll add that into your file. And another thing, I'd like for you to go back to your uh, primary care physician, and I noticed that you had some high level high blood pressure, so I'd like for that to be checked on and just know that it's monitored, and that would make me feel better. So do you have any questions for me? 
I have the time. Yeah, great. Okay. So I'll walk you over to the front and we'll get you scheduled.